Sugar tastes nice and sweet and is a customary ingredient in most dishes. Every beverage on grocery shelves mostly has sugar content. If ever you'd see zero sugar food and drinks, these are items that cost a bit more. Truly, a healthy lifestyle requires high maintenance. That said, sugar remains to be the devil in most food products. Sugar can cause weight gain and even increases your craving for more food. Sugar consumption has also been linked to the development of visceral fat. But if sugar tastes so good that it's become indispensable to kitchens and grocery shelves, can you still avoid eating it? Sugar is extracted from cane and beet and is then crystallized. When you eat too much of it, you could get addicted. This is due to the dopamine it releases to your brain. And dopamine is the exact neurotransmitter associated with addiction. Fortunately, you can still break the habit of eating too much sugar. It may not be possible to go zero sugar, but you can at least minimize it. 1. Know that sugars don't only come from sodas and sweetened drinks. People fail to realize that bread, pasta, and rice, especially the white variety, are rich in sugar. You may drop your soda bottles, but if you keep eating white pasta, then you just traded sugar for sugar. 2. Know the signs of sugar addiction. Not everyone who eats sugar can become a sugar addict, but knowing the levels of sugar addiction is rewarding at the same time. Once you feel that you can't seem to go through the day without consuming sugar, or that you're becoming irritable, then you may have to cut back on sugar with more determination. However, it's not advisable to go cold turkey. Your body is used to taking sugar and abruptly stopping can lead to headaches, mood swings, and anxiety. Doctors would recommend that you slowly withdraw from sugar. Give your body time to adjust to the changes in your lifestyle and eating habits. 3. Go on a sugar detox. A sugar detox is a time spent completely away from sugar. Compared to going cold turkey, a sugar detox is temporary. A five-day low-sugar diet can help break sugar addiction. A caveat, prepare to experience sudden hormonal and bowel changes, and some bouts of headache. You can extend your detox to three weeks if your body can take it. You may want to space out your detox program. For instance, go on a sugar detox in the first week of the month, then increase that period to two weeks in the next month. This adjustment allows your body to prepare for a low sugar diet without the side effects. 4. Read food labels. Make it a habit to read nutrition labels in everything you buy. Choose ones with zero sugar or low sugar content. Be mindful too of artificial and natural sugars. If a product claims to be sugar-free and yet there is no nutritional information available, be wary of it. Also, sugar-free may not mean a product doesn't have carbs. Choose sugar-free products that have fewer carbs, too. Pay attention to sugar alcohol in gums and candies. Examples of sugar alcohols are xylitol and sorbitol. Although they aren't as bad for health as refined sugar, they still contain calories and carbohydrates. 5. Eat balanced meals. Balance your sugar levels by eating balanced and healthy meals. Keeping your blood sugar levels within the healthy range can prevent sugar cravings or crashes. Combine your sugar intake with fiber, protein, and healthy cholesterol. Examples of food that you can eat with sugar are vegetables, olive oil dressings, beef, and eggs. You can also add whey protein shake to your diet. 6. Increase the good bacteria in your gut. Drink yogurt and probiotic milk so you can heal your digestive system. They are not too sweet yet they can satiate your taste buds and keep you healthy. Know that bacterial infection, like Uti, can be triggered by sweets. Bacteria thrive in sugar, so neutralizing your digestive tract with probiotic fiber can keep bacteria at bay. 7. Switch to natural sugar. There are a lot of healthy alternatives to refined sugar. Just look at your spice rack. You can sweeten your drinks with a drop of vanilla or a sprinkle of cinnamon. They're also devoid of calories, so you don't have to worry about getting fat. 
you may try ginger, chicory, cardamom, nutmeg, and citrus zest, too, for added flavor. Other alternatives are maple syrup, which is perfect for hot cakes, date sugar, and blackstrap molasses. Thanks for watching. Please, check the description box for more. Subscribe for more videos.